Fort Natchez Elementary is standing up against the bullies. It looks like recess here at Port Natchez Elementary. Right here, baby, on the pink line. But these kids are walking outside for a different reason. We were standing on these pink lines. And when viewed from above, creating a message that spells out their mission. We were spelling stand up because there was this boy that had been bullied because he was wearing pink. So these other two boys had started wearing pink too because they thought it wasn't fair for this kid to be bullied. Not only did students wear pink to stand up against bullying, they also received this book and this wristband to serve as a constant reminder on how to deal with bullies. What are we talking about today? Bullying. And they got reinforcement from an educator. Because a lot of times when we think of bullying, it's always the, the hitting aspect of it. So it's much more. And we want to let the kids know that, hey, I noticed bullying, and I'm taking a stand, and I'm going to say something about it. Fourth and fifth graders, starting at a young age, taking a stance. I want to help the people that have been bullied for they don't feel mistreated. Because we're all different in our own ways, and we all have feelings, and they don't need to be broken. Learning sensitivity, students coming together from varying backgrounds with a message of tolerance. In Port Natchez, Leslie Rangel, KFDM 6 News. And October was National Bullying Prevention Month across the nation.